This is question 18. College Board is asking about exponential growth, as we can see, because each year is 10% over the value from the previous year. Anytime you're multiplying the previous value by a constant rather than adding a constant, multiplying by a constant is exponential growth. So we start at 200. After one year, we have our previous value plus 10% times our previous value is 1 times 200 plus 0.1 times 200 is 1.1 times 200. After two years, which is the amount they're asking for, we have our previous value, 1.1 times 200 plus 0.1 times that previous value. which is 1.1 times 200 plus 0 0.11, 0 0.1 times 1.1 is 0 0.11 times 200, is 1.21 times 200, because I just added 1.1 plus 0 0.11 to get 1.21. I haven't multiplied these out because my final answer is in the form 200 times A, so I'm keeping the 200 separate. And the question asks for the value of A if the value after two years is 200A. The value after two years is 1.21A, so 1.21 equals A. College Board often asks about exponential growth or about distinguishing linear growth from exponential growth. So read these carefully, especially whether the increase is a percent of the starting value, which would be linear, the same as a fixed amount each year, or a percent of the most recent value, which makes it exponential. And come back soon for our next video. With math, there's always more.